Alrighty. Um, so really, I just need to just get started and just race out to the car park and uh, get it going. Uh, I've got my timer ready, which I believe starts when uh, you select 72 hour mode. So let's, uh, let's do it. I have to select a save first, so we want my what's my latest one? I think it's just that one. I think that's right. Which it'll be right. It can always be retimed. It's not the end of the world. Go, go, go. Gotta go fast. Gotta do a couple of things at the start. Pretty much just run from here to there. Just gotta be ready to skip these cutscenes. Another one. Go. Where do you suppose he went anyway? Not scared. Excuse me, Mark. Please look out. Watch where you're holding that bat. Uh huh. Madonna! Oh, Madonna! To the stairs. Coming through. Todd, look out! Todd, you son of a bitch. So many cutscenes. Goodbye, Otis. You're a true friend. I'll see you on the other. I'll see you on the other side, brother. Emergency bat. Just in case. You, have you seen my wife, Natalie? She I have not. Still be around here. <coughs> not now, Otis. Leave me alone. Hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Stop calling me. Just leave a message. Excuse me. Uh, we'll go up and grab some emergency juice and some skateboards. And we should be, um, we should be right as rain. How many should I take? Probably overkill. Oh, we've even got a gun. That's nice. I don't, this is this is overkill. I'm probably not going to need all this juice, but you never know. You never know. Jeez. All right to the car park. So it begins. Alright, here we go. Oh dear. This is gonna be fun. It's gonna be a good time. I believe you just go up here. Because then you change to the truck. Something like that. Probably getting out of the car too early, but we just want to... 
Oh, fine. Otis, what do you want, mate? And we, uh, do a bit of this. I think you go down, you swing a left. And I think you, you go down here. There's not that many down here as I thought there would be. Oh dear, okay, gotta be careful there. Getting snagged on things. That pop in. Goodness gracious. Alright. Car. I feel like the the cars were a bit more stiff in the original game. This one is a bit of they slide around. Car starts to smoke. When it's getting close to destroying. Whoa! Did I hit one of the rooftop ceiling signs? Let's check the map. Is there a better way of doing this? Maybe. So second, the second right. Maybe go. Maybe do a full lap, just so I'm not going through the loading areas much. But this pop in, Jesus, was it that bad in the original? Far out, man. The density is not too good down here. Maybe it's better just to stick to the top left of the map. Well, that's 1,000. That's nice. And then, yeah, then left, yep. Hopefully I remember that. Yeah, the density down here is not that great. Might be wasting my time. <laughs> wasting my time? What? No way. No way. This is great. worth going down here. This there's not that many down here. But then they do you go down there then you come back out and they respawn so it's not too bad. Your optic feels bad for the zombies. Oh, look, they, they had it coming, man. They had it coming. You know what they did. They just hung his... Look, that's true. That's true. And I've done some pretty crazy things when I've been hungry. But... I do need this achievement to get the real Mega Man blaster.
Jeez. Holy sh... <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh, I, I was looking for a, a shirt to wear. And I was like, yeah. We wearing the Lost in the Cheese shirt. Very, definitely deliberate. I'm glad you noticed, Optic. How you going, Grizzy? How are you? How are you going? How's life? So I got time to chat. If you got any stories for me, I, I've got time. Let me hear, let me hear. <laughs> going alright. Apart from doing this. But, you know, then I can do some more cool stuff with the game. Once I unlock the, the Mega Man Blaster, so it'll be... It'll be alright. I don't really have anything else to do tonight, so may as well do something. <laughs> but work's going good. Got some good stuff to be looking forward to next month. Um... Yeah, can't really complain right now, hey. And that's 2,000. Nice. Whoa, mama. I feel like this round's pretty good. Yo, Otis, what's up? Yeah. Be careful on that turn. Got to be careful there. Turn around. Let me out! I must get into the car.
<laughs> so dumb, man. Change car! Those loading screens are gonna get tiresome. Just load, man. Come on, we loaded this. How many times? Excuse me, mate. Get off of there. See, I think the car does smoke when it's about to cark it. Just want to see what it looks like. Oh, yeah. It's pretty obvious. Yeah, that car is smoking. That's when you know it's time to bail out. What if I go, what if, rather than turning into there, what if I just go down here and turn around? Do the zombies still spawn there? No. No, they don't. Oh. No, not as much. See, so you gotta go down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's see with the truck. I'll just see if I can get it more damaged. Yeah, we'll, go, we'll go up here again just to see the damage. Seems you can do go around twice as the truck and feel safe. Watch the turns.
Excuse me, mate. No! Unhand me, beast. Trolleys, man. Car slides or truck slides around. Sound effects are really good. Turn sooner, man.
Oh. Cool. Oh no! Oops. Panic! I found a woman. That's awesome, man. Gotta hit, gotta stop hitting that corner. That's not good, that's not gonna help us. Rubbish turn. Hopefully more zombies are out at night when they get more aggressive. I know they, they get more aggressive, but I, I don't know if that if their numbers increase. Hopefully, that'd be nice. soon.
Lose a bit of speed there. Come on! Squid. It is taking a gamble. Hey, young. Oh shit! Yeah, a bit off more than I could chew. That's right, that's why we've got the emergency skateboards. Oh, sorry to hear that. That's... That's probably, yeah, the best thing you can do to think about is that, yeah, you... You can be putting it to behind you soon. Have a good sleep. And tomorrow is a new day. Sorry to hear that though. It'd be really nice that around the the hour mark to be hitting around 25,000 but I might be that might be wishful thinking Fortunately, all you got is, in this area, you've got the bike. Oh, shit. You've got the bike, the car, and the truck. Um, you could go get the convict vehicle, but then you've got to waste time killing them. Which can be a bit... A bit iffy. So I'm hoping that the, the speed of the car makes up for it. That's overdoing it. That is overdoing it. 
Get the fuck off me. Well, we've hit 10,000. We're on our way. Just gotta do that four more times. Oh shit. We, we've got a trolley under our wheels. Sophie Richards! Oh no. Recipe Sophie Richards. God, I don't know how I'm going to hit like 25,000 around the hour mark. This might take longer than I thought it would. Someone's having with the camera. Because they're skipping the cutscene. It's the, um, it's in the achievement, uh, details, and it's also the, it's the town, it's the population of the town, uh, that the game is set in. Keep missing the truck, mate. Keep missing the truck. You'd be done at twenty one thousand ish. Goodness. Goodness gracious. Seems like it's better to just get the car as get get a new car as soon as possible because the truck is just it's slow and it controls like a like a brick. Excuse me. I don't know if it's worth going over to the left there. I think it's better just maybe it's better just go down straight into the tunnel. Save some more of the vehicle's health for down here. Whoa! What did I hit? The trolley? Oh, 
What's the what's the population of Tokyo? Jesus. That's too much. I don't have time for that. Oh, it is? Is it? I can't imagine that. All the people you'd pass every day. So many people. Too many people. I don't like it. Scoop chance lost. Oh no. Rip. And 70 million in China. Change. Want to keep, want to take note 
of how many I kill in an hour. So what are we currently at? 47. Come on, man, stop hitting the corner. What are you doing? You got one job. That one at the front was holding on for dear life. Yeah, I'll get right on that, Otis. Fifty minutes. Just go through there with zombie. Hey, squid, 
Are you still there? Or optic? Man. Oops a daisy. Yo, Ted, fine. Thank you for the follow while I'm doing a pretty mundane run. Appreciate it. We go on the distance. You'd think I'd be better at these corners by now. Hello? 56 coming up on an hour. What are we going to be at? 16,000 or something, maybe? Oh, come on, stop hitting the corners, man! What are you doing?
What? Anyone there? <laughs> So many trolleys. We're in the rhythm. Sixteen thousand eight hundred in the first hour. Ish. Yo, lazy Tyler. Let me hold on. Let me just make sure I'm reading that when I'm going straight. Get into the bush area. Go down the hilt. I could be doing it faster. So. If so walk, walk me through it. Walk me through it. Um, I'll I'll just clear this group. I'll get the car smoke in, then I'll switch. Because I just feel I feel like I could be doing it just that little bit more efficiently. And I'm second guessing how I remember doing it years ago. So we'll reset in a sec. I'll do a lap as the truck. And this is the butcher area, right? We'll reset. Down, down, down. Prices are down. So we're starting in the car, yeah? Go to the butcher area. So do you mean like, go to the butcher area, clear that group, then go down the ramp, then come back? Yo, Dill! Thanks for the lurk, mate. Exciting zombie slaying. So here, so what, you reckon we 
go straight here, clear this. Do a bit of this. How far down the ramp do I have to go? About, like, just go down as far as sort of like a big group of them is. Back again. And here. Oh, go to the line. Oh, yeah. Let's go to the... That, the, like, the speed bump. And just doing this... This round just over and over makes up for the, um... Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's quite consistent, isn't it? All right. We will... We will switch it up to this. Because I was really hoping by the... By around the hour mark... To be hitting around 25,000, but we only hit around, uh, was it 16,800? So I feel like I'm behind, I'm behind the professionals. But thank you, Lazy Tyler. I appreciate the, appreciate the, and then with the truck, with the truck, just go back to the, straight back to the car, or should I go down, like do a lap with the truck somewhere? Or is the truck really just to get back to the car? Because, yeah, last time I did this achievement on the original version was back... Back in, like, 2000 and... Whenever the game came out. That's how long it's been since I've done this achievement. Ex do you mean experts use the truck only? Never going back to the car. Really? Oh, yeah, it just, I felt like the, the zombies were spawning a bit differently to the original. It just felt, just something felt a little different. new a bit of more than I could chew out of the way motherfucker <laughs> move it dirt bag oh oh you can you can go into the butcher area the butcher area is there, right? Wait, no. Butcher area? No, yeah, butcher area is in the top left, isn't it? Oh, it is in the middle. Right, so we'll grab... So... Truck in the top left. Oh, car down. Oh, so then, yeah, you never use the car. I get ya. I get ya. I think. But My brain is fried. Oh, you made a video for people? Oh, I appreciate you coming into chat to... To help me out, because yeah, I just want to get it done. 
as soon as possible. So then I got the Mega Man Blaster ready to go. So I'd, I'd like to actually do the Infinity Mode for once because I've always struggled with it, but I know it'll be so much easier with the Blaster. And I might do some scuffed speedruns when the uh, the boards go live, just for a bit of fun. Just because it's, it's, it's been fun getting back into the game. It was one of my favorites on the 360. Okay, so so we go around with the truck and then we go in and then when it's this truck smoking, we go through that door there. I used to watch The Walking Dead while doing it. <laughs> Just zombies, zombie everything. Yeah, if I wasn't streaming, I could put on some YouTube sign. Oh, dude. Yeah, I didn't have a... When I got my 360, um, my only options were I had a CRT TV in my room because I was like 16. And then uh, my parents had like a... Like a mid 2000s, uh, like a plasma TV or something, and like it was, you you could slightly, you could read just a bit better on their TV, but on my CRT TV, I was like, what? They they were not thinking when they, they must have just made the game and tested it on, like the best TVs at the time. They're like everyone's got a TV like this, right? Yeah. Everyone's got a everyone's got a big fancy TV. Look not. But yeah, I remember that was a that was a huge deal. I could not read shit. Couldn't read shit. <laughs> How the fuck can people read this? No, I remember I remember being like, uh have I got the settings wrong? In the game. So did you... Tyler, did you time yourself doing this? Because I was... um, Because I was looking at the, the speedrun leaderboards and I saw that my friend Louis Copeland, he's done this in... He, he... His run took him two hours and like seven minutes or something. So I was like, oh yeah, that's doable. But I think I'm behind. Like, we're not even halfway yet. Oh, there is some food in there. I grabbed some orange juice just in case and a couple of skateboards. And then key. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm hoping I don't have to go running off for food at all. It's a very, very scuffed speed run if you can call it that damn trolleys I'm doing better now. Ah, oh, yeah, I figured because you, I got the um, uh, the kill ten thousand one before the achievement popped. But um, I figured if we if we get the achievement uh, before the number reaches it on screen, I'm gonna stick with it anyway. Just, just so I can submit it to the to the speedrun board, just for shits and giggles. Oh, really? The seven day survivor just it just tallies up your time playing infinite mode altogether. Well, that's easy. Now, see what you mean about never going back to the car because you have a 
The truck isn't even smoking yet. There it is. One more little lap. Oop. No, I don't want that. Oh, fuck off. Oh, let's swap this hunk of meat. Fuck you. Let's heal up just to be safe. Swap the board for a hunk of meat. Don't need this anymore. Miscuzzi. How handy is the fast forwarding time now? My god. Oh, it's just because it's because Frank is so massive. Um, like I know like to get through in infinite mode you gotta um, you gotta have lots of food how many survivors do you need to kill and psychopaths do you have to kill to um, ensure you've got enough food to reach the seven days in one go I, I love I love watching um, the odd YouTube video on people attempting the challenge on the original on the 360 and it's just it's so funny it is so damn funny like like their game crashing or like the Xbox overheating or something well they gotta like pause and leave it on overnight and just hope it's still on So fucking funny. Killed very little survivors. Really? Free items to spawn? See, I've barely played infinite mode. And all these years later I'm like, I should probably I should probably give it a good go by now. It's been a while. Oh, oh the cult. Right. Okay. Okay. Damo! <laughs> it's Damo! Mate, how you buddy going? <laughs> Hello, Eden. Hi, how you going? It's Corpse! It's Damo! Mate, you've come in at a, for a very, a very special stream. We are, um... We're going for the Zombie Annihilator achievement. Which used to be called the Zombie Genocide Achievement. G zombie Genocide Achievement. In the original version. So yeah, we are driving around, trying to find a car space, and uh, mowing everyone over. Until we hit, until that number in the bottom left uh, becomes 53,594. Oh, dumb, I, I had a feeling that's what you were doing. You're like, you know what? More people need to see this absolutely riveting gameplay. People need to see this. And it's not just, it's not it's not just it's it's the re, it's remastered. It's it's a zombie genocide and it's remastered. It's got a fresh coat of paint. It's you know it's a sight to behold. What were you playing, Damo? You got all the achievements already, Tyler. I've been alright, Damo. I've been alright. Just, uh... You know, keep busy at work. Been enjoying getting back into the Red Dead RP. And just, uh... Yeah, been spending my downtime just catching up on games like this. And then I figured, you know what? Let's go for this achievement. And I could have just sat here, all alone, in the dark in a dressing gown and done it offline but I was like nah let's stream it because Damo needs to see this 
We're getting closer to Pax, Damo. It is kind of satisfying, isn't it, Eve? The the it's like a um, it's like an ASMR stream. All the all the squishing and the squelching. What have you got? What have you got coming up this week, Damo? Well done, Tyler. Tyler, are you gonna do any speed runs? I noticed there was some changed altered achievements. I thought that was interesting. But there's a lot of the old yeah, the old uh, the old classics are still there. What's coming up to you this week, Damo? And Pax is getting closer. <coughs> the Australian Cup Grand Final. Nice. The sound effects are very nice. They did. They did well. Lots of sport for you. All the sport. Eden, thank you for the follow. I, I, pro I, I assure you, I don't usually do this. Oh, well. Well, Eden, I'll be, uh, you know, I, uh, I caught up with Damo early this year. I don't know if you saw him, um, a ch doing a charity event. He was doing Mario Kart, and there, there, you may have seen a, a guy dressed as Wario next to him. That was me. Believe it or not, that wasn't the real Wario. That was me in a costume. That was me. And I'll be seeing Damo again um, next month at PAX. Damo, are you just doing packs? Did, are you doing South by Southwest? Damo was great. Damo did. Damo did great. Ah. I see, I see. But yeah, packs is fast approaching. Very exciting, and it, it's uh, it, it's interesting, Damo. Because yeah, when I got the um, oh, when did I get the list? Like there's, there's that panel I'm co-hosting, and when I got the list of the contestants, I was like, oh, there's a name I recognise. It's like, hang on a minute, that Aaron guy knows Damo. Oh, it's nothing, mate. I just because I became shell friends with Shell Bunny earlier this year. We were just talking and I mentioned how I've done um, trivia hosting and a bit of emceeing and stuff. So she's like, oh, well, this is my first time doing it. Do you want to you wanna help me out? It's like, done deal, mate. Done deal. Because I've, I've, never, I've never hosted a PAX panel before. So, well, an IRL one. I've hosted uh, some online ones back during COVID, but I've never hosted an IRL one. So, so that'll be nice to tickle the old list. That'll be nice. It's gonna be good, man. It's gonna be great to see everybody. What's juice? Fr Have I got juice? Or is it what's juice, Frank? Is there a juice form of Frank? Are you going to Pax Eden? No, I haven't got all the mixed drinks yet. Um. I always just stock up on loads of orange juice and then I go do the and then I go do the game. I I rarely stop to mix drinks. Is there any combos in particular I should be that are the best? I don't know if I'm gonna go for all the achievements. I just wanna I just wanna get the good unlocks. You come up with a strategy for that as well. 
See, Tyler, you you know a whole bunch of stuff with the game. Like, I I feel like maybe you need to give the speedruns a go. If you're coming up with strategies, like you know more than most. You're an expert in the field. Unfortunately not. I want to, but it was Pax or a James Marriott here. And I... You chose James! Well, look, I don't know who James Marriott is. But he must be an alright fella to be picked over Pax. That's right. There's always next year. Thank you, Damo. And thank you for the raid again. Thanks for, thanks for the chat. Oh, mate. I'll, I'll see you there. Well, you got time to think about it, Tyler, because the I saw that the um, the boards don't go live until for like another ten days or something. So you got time to ponder. Excuse me. As efficient as this route is, I kind of miss the car. The car is fun. Well, I think most of the average times are around that, Tyler, so... You'd be in with a shot. And you got to remember... Like, for a lot of people, speedrunning is just for a bit of fun. You don't have to be going for the, the world record. You just got to do the best you can. Have fun doing it. Have a laugh. Just, just give it a go. Don't have to win. We're nearly halfway. I have to kill 50, 53,594. So we're nearly halfway there. Yeah, this is, this is, this is crazy. And I, I never thought I would be doing this challenge again. But just, I just, after playing through the remaster, I just, I feel compelled. And the thought of doing it on stream made me laugh. So I was like, screw it, let's do it. And then once it's done, it's done. Then I've got the then I'll have the real Mega Man Blaster and I can have fun in the the Infinity Mode. And I'll be ready for um, when the speedrun board goes live. So I just gotta put in just gotta put in the hard work tonight. And then it's done. Don't have to do it ever again. <laughs> But I mean, I've been very thankful of, for people popping in to say hello. Um, it uh, keeps me going. Oh, man. See, I want, I want the laser sword, damn it. I want to get the laser sword, but I just... Having the, the real Mega Man Blaster will make getting the laser sword just so much easier. So, like, let's just do it. It'll be fine. It'll be f it's fun. I'm having fun. Are you having fun? I'm having fun. I hope it's fast, Tyler. I'm I'm putting all my faith in you. Oh, I've still got the hunk of meat. Yeah! I'm putting my faith in you. Lazy Tyler, don't let me down. <laughs> Don't let me down! Thank you, Shell Bunny! That's, yeah, see, there's three! Cheese? That, that's... That's three I didn't have before. I'm lost in the cheese, that's right. <laughs> uh. <laughs> right? Like... Eden, let, let's... Like, let's be real. Zombie apocalypse happens. You've got your base set up, you know, you got a tree house or whatever. 
You got some weapons, you got food, you got a little farm going. You got your survivor pals. What are you gonna do in your free time? You're gonna find the next best vehicle, and you're gonna go on patrol, and um, you're gonna cull the zombie population a bit. You know, you gotta keep the numbers down. Oh no, Tyler, DoorDash is listening. That's it, yeah, that's right, Ian. So this, I'm practicing for when that happens. Show me the shirt, Shell Bunny. I need, I need, I need things to distract me with. Um, I've got a, I've got a hoodie version of this shirt, which I will probably wear. Um, I'm thinking I'll wear it for the panel. I'll wear the hoodie version of this, because the lost in the cheese. Please forgive me. It's funny, and it's, and I got, it, I got, it, I deliberately got an extra, extra, extra large. Like a real, like, I'm already an extra large dude, but I got like an extra big one because it looks really funny. It makes me happy. Well, not, not like a full distraction. I just need, I just need enough side entertainment to keep me sane while I drive this truck up and down over and over. So seeing this, so seeing this shirt will um, give me a little bit of extra strength. All right, we're about halfway. Well, we're halfway to we're halfway to fifty thousand. Well, let's just round down, shall we? So it's been an hour and a half. So we still got about an hour and a half to go. <laughs> How did my friend Louis do this in two hours? Must be a different difference with the versions. Bruh. Oh shit! Uh oh. Miscoozy. Ow. Please! So it's gotta be it's gotta be because it's it's the version, right? This this version is slower. Like there's 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 less density, right? All right, I will attempt to look at my phone and drive, as you sh totally should not do in real life. I, I, I reckon you're right, Tyler. That's what I was feeling, and I reckon if you feel that with, because you've already done this, I think, I think we're right. The pop in, like there was, there wasn't as much pop in in the original was there. Like, when you run around the park, like, the amount of zombies popping in just feels weird. It's consigning. Oh, when can I bring up my phone? Oh, I put the phone over there. I'll use my left hand. Hold on, Shellbone. I've got to find a... I've got to find when I'm going to... when I'm going to do it. Fuck. <laughs> Why can't I find a park? There's nowhere to park my vehicle. What is the meaning of this? Are oh, these fucking corners, man? Line her up. Diagnosed with your. <laughs> oh, I saw the first one. <laughs> with the autism and it was like a little cartoon character with a cowboy hat. Yaltism! <laughs> How <are> y'all? <laughs> Love it. Alright, second one. You just yeed your last whore. Ah, oh, you got the, the raccoon. I like that one too. I don't know if the first one I think is the winner so far. And number three. Mentally ill but very hot. I can see it's like it's all like ironic, like the black shirt with that kind of font, with the white plain text. I get it, but I feel like, I feel like their bestness is in the order that they arrived in. I think it goes from best to worst, one, two, three. Um, from my very quick glances at this, 
See now, if this was real life, I'd be dead. If I had, if I had been looking at my phone while driving a truck in a crowded car park, myself and probably some other people would be dead. So just make sure if you got to use your phone in the car. Oh fuck! If you got to use your phone in the car, make sure you pull over and wind up the window so the zombies can't get in. Yo, I think the Yoltism one is the best. Are you gonna are you gonna get that and wear it for the panel? Lucky I brought more skate for uh, Fuck off! Uh, oh. Damn it! Oh bollocks. Uh, fuck! Oh dear. I'm really good at this. It's your fairy fake costume. Do you want me to just wear normal clothes for the panel, or do you want me to bring my Wario costume? Do you want me to bring Wario for it? I'll do it. I can bring it. I have one, I have one pair left. The other one I threw out because it got covered in cake at the Generosity Slumber Party. And I was like, I'm not taking, I am not repacking. A Wario onesie that's covered in cake. So it went in the bin. Alright. I'll consider it. Because I feel like the, the Wario outfit, like the color, the bright yellow and the purple, might uh, match your um match your fairy outfit. I'll have it, I'll have it just in case. But then it would be funny. But then it would be funny if I'm there in my typical outfit, like black pants, black boots, black hoodie with the loss and the cheese on it. Like having the having the very dis different styles would be amusing as well for the audience. Like people would be like, these these two haven't synced up at all, have they? <laughs> har har har. Whatever you wear will be covered in cake. I don't want to cover more of my clothes in cake. I don't want that, Tyler. What do you want me to show me with the skateboard? I don't know if I have time. I'm already losing so much time on this, on this very professional speed run. Lap Fay. I'll send you a photo of my wings. That's not a that's not a message you receive every day. Look at my wings! Look at them! <laughs> oh You'd have to You'd have to because I've got links disabled in the Twitch chat. You'd have to send it via Discord or or via Twitter or Instagram. You can find me on most social media channels as K0R8Z. That's late speak, of course. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing content. Turn around. Right. All right. Give me a moment. I'll go. I got. I got it. Fuck. I'm okay. When the when the truck is smoking, it's time to reset. I got. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing the trucks too far. I gotta settle down. I'm out of control. Out of the way, nerds. <laughs> right. Let's. Line it up. Fuck! Turn around! Come on, you bitch. Right. Bloody hell! Like, those are definitely... Uh, a higher caliber of your typical fairy wings. 
Like they, they look like they've looks like there's been some expert craftsmanship with those. Oh my god, my um I'm 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 very devious even. I'm very devious. My friend Marsley is gonna love that. So my friend so I've told you about my friend Marsley. Who will be with me for a lot of the weekends. We she's she's accompanied me to the last three PAXs. And she's always been like my unofficial assistant. And I don't force her, but she's always like, no, I'll hold your stuff while you do your Omegathon. And then I, uh, cause I always, she always gets my plus one ticket cause she's one of my besties. So, uh, but whenever I've chatted to her this year, she's always telling me about how she's got a new damn book in this fairy book series. And these fairies she tells me about don't sound very innocent. But she gets very excited to tell me that she's got the next book in this series about these naughty little fairies. And I'm like... Um, so I think you he might have something to talk about. Uh, I can't remember. I can't remember. She's told me like... A handful of times and I can't remember because I'm, I'm I don't remember shit. I'm a horrible per I'm a horrible friend. I can't remember Eden. I just know it's it's the fairies don't sound innocent at all. It's fairies that are not pure. <laughs> Oh, the truck is smoking. Let's not risk it. Excuse me, mate. <laughs> they never are. What are you... No! No! What are you talking about? No. No! Say it isn't so. You're lying. You're lying. You're telling me that... Wait, what are, what are fairies from childhood things? Like Tinkerbell and, uh, I'm trying to, I was like, I was like, what's the, what's the fairy in P the cartoon Peter Pan called again? I'm like, yeah, Tinkerbell. And then I'm like, what's the, <laughs> this, is, <laughs> this is how whack my brain is right now. I was like, what's the, what's the fairy in Hook called? Played by Julia Roberts. Like, it's Tinkerbell as well, called cool, you idiot. Just looks Peter Pan. <laughs> there's, there's, there's Tinkerbell, and there's Tinkerbell, and there's um. Now that you mention it, oh, Rogue! I didn't catch. I didn't see your name there. I saw the blue. Hey, you going, Rogue? Two is great. I reckon it'll be a. Well, I guess if this one sells well, there'll be a remaster of two on the way. But now you mention it, yeah, Tinkerbell was a bit of a... Um, a bit crazy, hey. Ben and whose little kingdom? What are you talking about? You're almost at, almost at 100k hours on Steam for this game. What? I can't say I've seen it even. <laughs> Skin tell? What? Hey, I'm really enjoying the game you're playing. <laughs> oh yeah. I'd love to team up sometime. Add me on Discord so we can chat. Can't wait. I'm gonna have to pass, I'm afraid. Skin tell? Our relationship is it's moving too fast. Like we've we've only just met. I think it's too soon for us to be teaming up. It's just we got, we're moving too fast. Whoa! My truck. I'm gonna have to politely decline. 
What's a honey pot? What's a honey pot, Shell Bunny? <laughs> like commitment issues. What? Me? Commitment issues? Never. Never, never, never. I am very reliable. Fuck. Don't get your hand off my penis. <laughs> Here we go again. I'm going crazy. Get out of the fucking way. Honeypot is when it's a hot person trying to scam you using their attractiveness. That sounds great. Where are the hot singles in my area? <laughs> like, hey kid, you want to know how to get the zombie annihilator achievement quicker? Yes! Yes, I do! Good. And I hope, I'm glad, that it's not just on account of me being hot, but also because you want something of value out of it. Okay. Tell me more. <laughs> uh, I am, uh, I am K0R8Z on everything. It's, it's lead speak for calls. Because, uh, lead speak is still cool. That's right, Eden. It's moving too fast. The relationship is moving faster than this truck. <laughs> uh, oh, we've hit over 30,000. <laughs> Shove back. Turn around. Every now and then my truck gets a little bit lonely. Wait, 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 I need to, I need to, I need to think of, um, more things to, to put on my channel. Like, I don't know, I don't know what to do with all the points. Rock and stone, brother! Rock and stone, brother! I've just got a bunch of little things that I just enjoy making, but I don't know what else to do. Sometimes I have a redemption where you can spend, like, 10,000 points, and I gotta put my warrior costume on, but that's, like, really it. I don't know what to do, I'm not... I'm not a very good streamer! I'm not a, I'm not a good... I'm not a good content creator! Me, <laughs> oh. New truck. Steven Chapman trade card. Uh, what? Kimmy Raid. Hello? 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 Anyone Hello? 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 Anyone there? Hello? Kimmy DNC. Thank you for the rave. Welcome to the grind. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Anyone there? Anyone there? Anyone there? Hello? Hello? I've covered war as you know. <laughs> Give me DNC, thank you for the raid. Welcome on in, raiders. Hello? Hello? Do you like driving up and down a tunnel, running over zombies to get a little Xbox achievement? Well, well, by golly, you've come to the right place. My name's Corbs, and every night of the year, I run this achievement back to back. <laughs> no, that's a lie. That is a blatant fucking lie. <laughs> uh, what were you playing, Kimmy? Were you playing... Were you playing the Dead Rising Deluxe Remaster? <laughs> Anyone there? 
Anyone there? Anyone there? Hello? Are you actually enjoying it, Aiden? <laughs> I'm going a little mad, Kimmy. Tell me, how, how the bloody hell are you? What were you streaming? And um, what do you... What's your... <laughs> Trying to make sure it doesn't sound rude. What's your deal? <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> what are you about? <laughs> I was playing this. It's so fun. Just wrapping my first run and then a chave. A ch a, why am I saying like a chavement hunting? Is this your. Are you telling me that this is your first ever playthrough of Dead Rising? Is this your first ever playthrough of a Dead Rising game? Oh! Oh, well, you'll be getting much more out of it then. Oh, that's lovely. See, I I can still remember how excited I was back when, like, the game, the original game came out when I was, like, 15 or 16. Like, and I was so excited to get it. Um, and it's been really fun revisiting it. But I know all the secrets. It's all been, uh, it's all been done. So, like, this is fun for me to an extent, but it's not as fun... Like, you've got all the surprises left to go, which is exciting. So, I hope you have a good time with it. And if you're ever struggling with it, don't worry, because we all have. <laughs> I did off the record with my husband years ago, but never haven't played anything else in the franchise. Ah, oh, well... I reckon if this one sold well, I reckon we'll be looking at a remaster of the second one. And, um, this, yeah, the second one was the first one to have co-op, so, so you'll be able to do, you'll be able to do some more co-op with your husband. <clears throat> the umbra, I feel like the umbrella is an underrated tool in your toolkit, you know? You know what I mean? It just, it's a shame it doesn't get more kills. <laughs> That's right, Shelby, we got raided by Kimmy DNC, who is currently doing their first playthrough of this, which is very cool. But Kimmy, what do you, what do you usually stream? What's your, like, I, my focus over the last year has been uh, Red Dead, Red Dead Roleplay. Blah, 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 blah. Red Dead Roleplay. That's been my thing over the last year. What's your thing? Those damn cultists. I remember the, the first time coming across them. A little bit creepy. A little bit creepy. But it's good when you take them out. All the yellow corpses lying around. You're like, yeah, that's nice. I did that. But in case no one, in case you didn't know this already, Kimmy, this is the best strat to get the zombie, uh, the zombie annihilator achievement. Um, I was very lucky, Lazy Tyler here in chat, uh, has been helping me optimize the route so that hopefully I'll have this done before bedtime. And I can go to sleep knowing that I've got the, uh, that I've got the, uh, real Mega Man Blaster. It's like Christmas. Love Resident Evil and retro games. Nice. I play a lot of the, a lot of a lot of the games. I never got to play as a kid and started playing Souls like Souls again. Well, you are braver than me then. I I suck at Souls like games. Um, I am I'm rubbish. I'm doing I'm rubbish at them. But Resident Evil, that's cool. I've been meaning to go through and play... Uh, I have uh, Resident Evil 2 and 3, the HD remasters, on my to-do list. I'm very excited for those. I'm not looking forward to being chased by Nemesis and Mr. X, though. I'm not looking forward to that, but I'm sure that will be funny. Um, but how good is it now as an adult that now it's like I have money? 
and you can go back and you can play all these games you missed as a kid. Like that, the, that just feels so good. It's like, yeah, I can just buy it now. No one can stop me. <laughs> it's my time. <laughs> Trash at platforming? Oh, you see practice. You started Crash Bandicoot. Those games get really hard. Those games get really hard. I, uh, I recently, this year, I finally finished the Crash Bandicoot trilogy and number four. The last couple of levels in four really, really pushed me to my limits. Not gonna lie. That last level. I was losing my mind. But it's good. Have you played, speaking of platformers, have you played Banjo-Kazooie? That's my jam. Look, Crash Bandicoot's fine. But have you played Banjo-Kazooie? Our uh, Lord and Savior, banjo and or Kazooie. Now I'm gonna need someone to do some quick maths for me real soon, in seven minutes. So in the first hour, we killed about 16,800 zombies. So keep that written down. Right, write that on down. Sixteen thousand eight hundred. When it hit, when my little fancy timer up there hits two hours, I want to take the amount we're up to now, and then deduct sixteen thousand eight hundred to find out approximately how many we've killed in the second hour. Is that can any can any is, can anyone do that for me? In Six minutes. Please. You recently got a 64 with Donkey Kong 64? You're in for a treat. That game is very good, but it is a slog. The first playthrough is very good. And you really feel like you get your money's worth a couple of times over. But going back to it is a little daunting. I've only ever finished the game once. I've never been able to finish it again because I just... It's a lot. It's a lot of game. And that DK rap though, what a jam. It's a very cool... It's a cool game. I remember I remember seeing... I remember going to... I guess I remember being a kid and going to the mall with my family and then seeing on display, like on TV, they had the, the DK rap playing over and over. And I was like, what is that? Because I'd never played a Donkey Kong game before. But I had played Banjo-Kazooie and, and a bunch of other 64 games. So I was very, very interested. And then, yeah, we got it for Christmas or something. And my God, it was a slog to finish that game. Beating K. Rule at the end. That was tough. That was very tough. He's the first member of the DK crew. With his coconut gun. If he shoots, yeah, it's gonna. <laughs> now I'm gonna go through the whole rap again. Um, Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong's next, right? Diddy Kong's gotta be next, right? He's back again, and about time too. And this time, he's in the mood. He can fly real high with his jetpack on. Uh, and with his pistols out. He's one tough cock. Huh, DK. <laughs> Diddy Kong Racing is my jam as well. Diddy Kong Racing is amazing. One of my all-time favorites. K. 
Kimmy GC, thank you for the follow. It's been wonderful chatting to you. I will have to. I'll have to come check out your resident eviling sometime. Thank you very much again for the raid. Very kind of you. Especially. And of course, another thanks to Damo before. My figurative hat. I take off my hat figuratively for you both for raiding me while I'm doing this. It's very honourable of you. Three minutes away. I'm going to need some mats. Shell buddy, are you still there? Shell bear? Help! Help! I am going to require assistance. This has been good though. I really appreciate the chats because like the last 10,000 zombies have just flown by. <laughs> He's the first member of the DK crew. Huh. Shit. Oh dear. Oh, come on, man. Be gone, demon. I require a fresh truck. For I am all out of trucks to give. <laughs> Miss Scoozy. Oh, 159. If he shoots gun with his coconut gun, he can fire in spurts. Oh, 30 seconds to two hours. If he shoots, yeah. starting to set in the reality that there's still another whole bunch to go. Oh, we're at two hours, so we're at 36,600. So what's 36,600 minus 16,800? I have trouble quick matching at the best of times, but while I'm driving a truck, doing these maneuvers, it's even harder. Stupid is and stupid does. Yeah. Oh boy, let's go back again. Oh, I'm not going to risk it. Let's re replace the truck. <clears throat> 6,000.
please. Otis! If he shoots, yeah. That's helping by doing a few little more laps around that area. Nearly to 40,000. And then it's kind of the home stretch. Come on. I've got some Reese peanut butter cups in the cupboard ready to go as a reward. Yeah, yeah. Out of the way, scumbag. The first member of the DK crew. Huh. Are you winning, son? We're nearly to 40,000. Tyler, can you do me a favor? Wait. Can you? Hold on. So in the first hour, I killed 16,800. And then I wanted to... I did, And then I wanted to... Uh, and then I wanted to... Um... Never mind. I've forgotten them. I've forgotten the numbers. <laughs> but I'm pretty. I'm. I'm pretty. I'm fairly sure that yeah, this is definitely. We've killed more zombies in the second hour than we did the first hour. So that is definitely a thing. 
No pressure. I... Forgotten. I think it was like... I think it was like 34,600 minus 16,800, I think. Something like that. And I just can't for the life of me maths it right now. My brain. My brain! My brain! Forty thousand. When I joined you, you were probably at sixteen K kills, and within the first twenty minutes, you're like thirty K kills. That sounds about right. One man wolf pack. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the excitement. This riveting challenge. I'm I'm going for that damn achievement where you gotta kill fifty-three was it fifty-three thousand five hundred and ninety-four zombies because reasons. So we're doing it. <laughs> How are you? How's it going? We're just having a good old chat while I do this. Have you played the remaster? See, I haven't done this achievement since the since the year the original came out. So this is definitely down a this is definitely a trip down memory lane. Hello? It's, it's just the first game, unfortunately. But you watch, if this one sells well, they'll probably do a remaster of the second one, too. But now, here's a question for the Dead Rising fans in chat. So, you know the way in number three, the guy you play as is one of the 50 kids in Carlito's list... Like, his name wasn't on the original list. Yeah. Fuck. But then, with the remaster, I saw on Reddit that they haven't gone and added his name to the list with this version either. So, the question I have is... Is 3 canon? Yo, Battle Tango. Yeah, I remember, I remember a lot less about 3 than the other two. Like, I think I enjoyed the vehicles, but I don't really remember much else. Well, if that's... It might be that they've... Yeah, it, number three might not be canon anymore. Like, maybe maybe the deluxe remaster is like a reboot, in a sense, where they'll, do, they'll remaster two, and then they'll create a new three or something. One thing I don't... Like, I'm not sure what I remember. But did I, do I remember correctly that 3... Kind of revealed that Isabella is kind of a villain by that point? Is it? Do I remember correctly? That you find out that she's not so good anymore? Like, because if that's true, like, I, don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like it at all. I recently replayed, um... Case Zero, and then I was gonna replay Case uh, West, but I forgot. I forgot. Ah, uh, yes, I I really enjoyed State of Decay. 
I liked the second one, but the first one, I sunk a lot of time in the first one. That was awesome. That was sick. I hope State of Decay 3 is good. Just the co-op in 2 felt a bit... I don't know, something fell off. Oh, she wanted Nick to redeem... Oh, okay, so I, I'm remembering wrong. See, I'm like, I don't want Isabelle to be bad. Imagine if they could do, like, a remaster, like a remake of State of Decay 1 and add multiplayer. That would be awesome. Who's the girl in the wheelchair again? I can't remember, so I, there's so much I don't remember. Like, I played through Dead Rising 1 and 2 a few times. But 3, I only finished it once. Which probably says a lot. I don't know, I can't remember. <laughs> that makes two of us. Quick, somebody Google. <laughs> like, I think I remember seeing someone in a wheelchair in Case West or something. And I think my first reaction was, oh my God, is that Isabella or something? I, I, but I can't remember. I can't remember shit. I can't remember shit, man. Oh, yeah. Can Call of Duty go back to normal? I just can't be bothered with Call of Duty anymore. Not that I, I was never, like, a diehard fan, but I have fond memories of playing, like, modern, for, but modern Warfare 1 and 2, Black Ops 1 and 2, multiplayer back in the day. But now I'm like, I just can't be fucked, man. It's even just the, the file installation size. Like, Jesus Christ, dude. Why is it 100 gigs, man? Fix your shit. Get your shit together! What are you doing? Hello? 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 Wait, 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 Yeah, it felt... Yeah, the co-op felt off. I would have preferred if it was like... Just yeah, one shared community. Like, bringing people over from your community. And, like, juggling them and that. I was like, this is... I was like, this is... Needlessly annoying. That's how I felt at the time. I was like, I won't even bother. I'll just play single player. Because I don't want to deal... I don't want to deal with this noise, man. Yeah, and then every time you load up the game, it's like, installing the fucking shaders or something. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? What do you mean it's not all installed in under 100 gigs? Get fucked, dude. And oh, it's time for an update. Oh, in the next game, that's also 100 gigs. Now with every copy of Call of Duty, a free external hard drive. For an extra hundred dollars. Can't believe we still haven't found a car park. Startup is louder than my ex-girlfriend. Sheesh! <laughs> That's me trying to be young. <laughs> Fuck you, zombie! See you in hell!
Oh, what? Ah, oh, hit. Whoops. Oopsie daisy. Clown's still there, and yeah, when he dies, he falls on him, and he's like, <laughs> it's like, Ugh. and Frank's just like, oh my god, he's like, what the, what the hell? <laughs> the psychopaths are so wild, they're crazy. It's a little frustrating the way they change them. Um, uh, Cl is it Cliff? Like, it, it just always made me laugh when he's always like, You're just a filthy commie. <laughs> You're Viet Cong, aren't you? Like, I thought it was funny. Like, it's, it's meant to be funny, but they changed it. You're nothing but a filthy communist. Yeah, nightmare. Oh, I don't blame. Yeah, playing that when you're when you were you really young, that'd be fucked up. So I was lucky when when the when the first game came out. I was like, I think I was 16. I think. I'm pretty sure I was 16. And yeah, there was one school holiday where I had I had some time. I had some free time, so yeah, I did this achievement on a school holiday. Like, yay! I've achieved so much! The cl yeah, the clown is... The clown is a bit, a bit scary. People love clowns, don't they? That's why... That's why whenever I'd play killer in dbd I'd, I'd usually play as the clown just in case you got paired up against survivor players that had a fear of clowns <laughs> i gotta take every advantage i can get <laughs> <laughs> oh that's right he's bro yeah, he's brother he's like and he's like weren't you a willamette you're frank west you son of that's right. I don't think I've played Evil Within, but I don't usually play horror games. I avoid them. I was even really scared playing um, Slender the Arrival back in the day. I, I, I got so scared that I had to wait to play it at uh, during the day, and I would ask my... Well, my girlfriend at the time would watch me play anyway, but I'd be really like, you got to sit here with me the whole time, right? And I can only play it during the day. Like, you got to sit here. Because it's freaking me out. That bit where you're down in the mine and the kid's chasing you? Fuck that. Get fucked, man. Get fucked. <laughs> Evil Within. I will have a Google later. I pretty, I'm pretty sure I haven't played it. I know, Tyler, but it's... It's too much, man! I tried... I remember someone... Got me to play Outlast on stream. And yeah, I only played it for a few hours and I'm like, nah, I'm done. I couldn't... I was like, nah, I'm, I'm good. I, I finished the section where there's like... This guy with like big long scissor hands. Or scissor fingers or something. Like he's like a doctor. And he's chasing you around the ward. And then he, he, you kill him. Like he gets stuck in the elevator. Like I did that, and I'm like, nah, I'm done. I'm good. I am done. 
Ah, uh, just, I can't. I can't do it. It's too much. It freaks me out. Yeah, that's, yeah. I just, nah. I was like, I, I'm, nah. I'm done. Oh, yuck. Oh, I, yeah, I remember looking around and being like, hey, what's that? Is that a tree? And then, no, it's, it's fucking Slender Man watching you from the top of a mountain. So gross, dude. It's so, ah. Oh. oh, yuck. Oh, I hate it. I hate Slender Man. Remember how popular Slender Man was, like, like a decade ago, you could, it's just Slender Man this, Slender Man that. Could not fucking escape Slender Man. And did they end up doing a good movie or anything? Like, did they even... Was there even like a half-decent movie made about it? I remember there was like a, a YouTube series. Uh, Marble Hornets or something. I remember watching a bit of that, but it was... Dr it, it dragged on so fucking much. Well, we've got under, we've got under 10,000 zombies to go. Home stretch. Home stretch. Oh, yeah, it feels like Escape the Backrooms is like the new Slender Man, I guess. The concept of the backrooms is pretty creepy. Because there's been times where, like at university and malls and stuff where yeah you go into like just an area that's really just out of the way and it just feels so bare and just it's just it's weird it's just got a weird vibe and you have the thought of being like lost there or trapped or something like oh yuck I don't blame you. I don't blame you, Wolfpack. It's a very interesting concept. I don't know if adding, like, monsters and stuff to them benefits it. I feel like just being lost in back rooms is, is weird enough by, on its own. I don't know if it needs monsters. Like, I've seen a couple of those short videos where there's, like, they're going through the back rooms and then there's, like, this big, tall thing that's, like, screaming, like, ah! Like, it's like screeching or something. Oh, there's an actual game? I haven't played any of the games. I've just watched a couple of videos online. Because, like, I had my Slenderman days. I'm not racing out. I'm not. I'm not racing out to replace Slenderman. I remember while I was at uni, some guy wanted to make a Slender Man short film. And I remember we spent more time because we would film it in some of the buildings at night. And I remember we spent more time like scaring each other than actually filming it. It was so dumb. I don't think it ever got done, finished. Good times. It's on Steam, eh? Mm. I might have a... I'll have a gander. Have a look-see. If we've got this right... Tyler, have I done... Have I killed like 10,000 in the last half an hour? I hope I haven't lost momentum. But it has been nice just chatting away and not thinking about this. Like my hands are my hands are doing the controls, but I'm not I'm 
I'm not really even thinking about it anymore. We've just been kill we've just been killing more zombies, Wolfpack. Just killing more zombies. Oh, the truck's smoking. Oh. I need a new truck. Get in the truck! <laughs> I'll- I, I, I will Tyler. I'm just- I had enough trouble getting Discord open and looking at photos. We just gotta- we just gotta- we gotta see this through. We gotta get it done. We're so close. I can almost taste it. Find the car park. <laughs> dum 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 dum. I love ice cream. I love. Good old classic Neapolitan. You got your chocolate, you got your strawberry, you got your vanilla. What more, what more do you need? I don't know if I'd scream for Neapolitan, but I'd kill for it. Oh my god! Another one! Hello Spectre! Jesus! It's another bloody raid, mate! G'day! How we doing? It's going well, I think. We're nearly- we've nearly done this stupid achievement again. How are you? What were you playing tonight? Hello there. General Kenobi! Hello there! We've been- we've been running over zombies for over two hours. You're playing this. Are you doing- were you doing a normal playthrough or were you doing this damn achievement as well? We're nearly there! First time playing. That's- we had another person in earlier that they've been playing for the first time as well. And I'm very envious because you've got all the all the cool stuff to look forward to while because I've played it a bunch of times. I know everything that's coming. I'm having fun, but I know everything that's coming. So for people that it's their first ever playthrough, hell fucking yeah. It's a good time. It's a good bloody time. But you see in here, this is the strat. To I uh, Complete the challenge where you got to kill 53,594 zombies. Uh, 
It's a lot of just um, driving around. It's just driving around. And I, I'm really looking forward to it being over. Well, you saw it here first, spec. This is how you get it. This is how you do it, mate. This is it. This is the strat. Thanks to Lazy Tyler here. We've, uh, we've got it, uh, we've got it down pat. I can see that, being a Resident Evil fan and enjoying this. Have a good sleep, Battle Tanker. Get some sleep, goddammit. You like the park bench, but you can't put it in your pocket. I'm so focused on this, I can't look away. Well, you're picking the, the best time to be staring at it because we're nearly into the 50,000s. We're nearly to the, we're nearly to our goal. It's, it's hypnotic, it's hypnotic, isn't it? Well, yeah, you can put all the, all the items in your pockets. But yeah, the park bench, you've always got to be carrying. Guardians, you bro. Nice to meet you. We're nearly at 50,000. The parking garage. Uh, so... So you know the way you come out the warehouse from the security room and you're in, what is it, Paradise Plaza. You run up towards the cinema, but you head out that uh, door to the park. Then pretty much go straight ahead or go across the, um, you'll see like a, a, a nice little area with flowers. Uh, cross that. And straight over there, you'll find the uh, the tunnel that leads to the car park. And then there you'll find the motorbike and the, the car. And then you can drive down into these tunnels. Definitely, before you leave Paradise Plaza, grab a skateboard if you can. Just so you can get, a, get over there quicker. Hope it helps. But there's, so, there's, there's so much to do in the first game. It's great. I, I would love to be able to play it for the first time again. So enjoy it while you can. Take your time. Take your time. If you can condense it down, Tyler, I'd love to know. I think that's one I wouldn't mind going for. I think that's an... Uh, that one would be fine. Oh, you definitely want to do... You definitely want to do multiple playthroughs. But yeah, really take your time. Explore. Um, because yeah, it's... Like, I still have fun. But it gets to the point where you, you know... You know the route. You know the best weapons. You know the best routes. And you don't... And it's hard not to stick with that. It's, um... I just, I just find myself doing the exact same thing every time. And I just wish I could play it fresh again and make mistakes. But I just, I know it too well now. I can never get that back. Come on. <laughs> oh, yeah. The time limit was a bit... Yeah, it's in the back of your head. You're like, oh. It's like uh, Majora's Mask. Like going from Ocarina of Time, like Zelda, to Majora's Mask. It is a bit like, oh. Oh, there's the achievement. That's 53,594 zombies overall on my save file. But we were not stopping until we see that number on screen. Let's fucking go. It's weird, but, but yeah, the older you get, or the more time you put in, you're like, yeah, the time's not too bad. But at first you're like, I don't know if I like this restriction, man. It's weird.
Whoa. Nearly there. Oh, that's right. The time's gone in those ones. I never touched four, mind you. I never played four. I don't, I, I don't know if I ever will. I don't know if I ever will. a god oh i don't know if i like that so i think I, I think i got that impression from the trail and i was like nah i don't know it just felt just didn't feel right come on you son of a bitch Maybe if it's ever, like, really cheap, I'll consider it. I'll consider it. Great game to play after going Christmas shopping at the mall. If I can get to the, if I can get to the amount, like like it was if it was legit, don't have to have to do it again. Guardian as well, thank you for the follow. And then I can submit it to the speedrun leaderboard for a giggle, because yeah, there's a there's a zombie genocide category, and you can only you can't stop the clock until you hit until that number hits the uh, hits the amount. So it's got to be like like it was legit. Oh, I was not watching the truck, Smoke. Oh, bollocks. Oh, shit. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, the boards aren't open yet. Um, but my mate, the Louis Copeland, for the old version of the game, uh, has got the record of, like, two hours and four or seven minutes. On console. So that's why, that's why I felt so confident about it. Yeah, I'll do, I'll, I'll have it done in about two hours. <laughs> I think Louie had a much better route than me. And I, yeah, I think the density of the, the crowds is better. 
I think we're right about that. But you watch, when the board go, when the leaderboards go up, my time will probably be absolutely shite compared to other people. So I might not submit it at all, but we've come this far. We've come this far. Sub 250, let's go! <laughs> we are so close! Wait, no. Yes, we, we're, we're nearly there. We're so freaking close. Scarface Daniel, thank you for the follow. You're in just before we hit the amount we need. We're so bloody close, mate. Come on. Oh, I hit the thing. Hello there. General Kenobi. I keep hitting that stupid thing. Do a barrel roll. Do a barrel roll. Come on. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Yes. Yes. Oh my god. Yes!